Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Jeff at Lockdown Security and I'm bringing you a video today of a 2013 BMW M3. What a beautiful car this is in a beautiful blue color. What we did to this vehicle today was a Beamer Tech rear view camera interface to run the rear view camera through the factory iDrive screen as well as a multi-angle view front camera, a black view dash camera and a cell link B dash cam battery. So I'm going to briefly show you some of the things on the outside of the vehicle first. Uh, one of them being the front view camera right below the M that we've got on the license plate bracket. It's right there. What's cool about this front view camera is it can see not only front, but it can see left and right, which I'll show you in one moment. And then we also did the rear view handle cam. It's very difficult to see, but my finger is on the camera right there. It's the OEM trunk handle. That's how uh, the camera mounts, so it looks like it came from the factory. I'm gonna hop in this vehicle here, show you the iDrive screen, close the window because it's snowing out. This is the front view camera. Now you're gonna see, essentially, there's the garage door that you see in the image. Basically on the right hand side, there is the left hand side, which you see over there. This camera that we're using is a multi-angle camera, so if I hit, uh, there's a control button that we've mounted right there. If I hit the control button, it basically switches between the various sources. And I've got, unfortunately I didn't do the install on this car. There is another control button in here to switch the angle of the front camera, but that gives you an idea. One other thing I forgot to mention is we did do a Beamer Tech Smart View HD Flex. That is essentially a uh, Wi-Fi cellular phone mirroring adapter. So if you have a Google phone, Android, or you have uh, an iPhone, such as I'm using here to film this video, you can mirror everything from your phone screen onto the factory iDrive screen. So if you wanna use navigation like Google Maps or Waze or something along those lines, or you wanna play a video from your phone, we can now do that on the factory iDrive screen of this vehicle. So I'm just gonna hit the button again to switch back. Now that's all factory iDrive. Now, if I put the vehicle in reverse, you will see the reverse camera with active guidelines. Now what we did on this vehicle was the Beamer Tech MMI rear view camera interface. And as it turns out, uh, if you wanna use Smart View HD Flex, you must go with the MMI interface. But, and this is a but on this particular vehicle, this vehicle has OEM PDC, which is Park Distance Control. And the only way you can retain that is if you use the Beamer Tech OEM integration module, which as it turns out, the customer actually would prefer. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna be swapping the module in the future. We'll make another YouTube video at that point, but this gives you an idea of what the MMI uh, interface does. Now, the MMI interface does not allow you to retain the OEM PDC control. So OEM PDC control would have a picture of a car there, some other images here that would show you how far away you are from an object. And then the camera image would be in the middle. In this case, the whole screen is the camera image and uh, the customer, as mentioned, does not uh, like that. So uh, lastly, here is the Blackview dash camera. The customer provided this. Now the customer doesn't have an SD card, so that's why it's unplugged right now. It gives you a constant warning that there's no SD card if you don't have it plugged in. And then cell link B, which is the dash cam battery. There's the box right there. I mounted it in the kick panel behind the carpeting. It fit actually very well. We've got it wired up into the, uh, the fuse box up front. And essentially what that allows this customer to do is rest assured that his vehicle battery will never be affected by the dash camera because the cell link B battery is what is powering his dash camera. The cell link B battery is recharged when the car is running, but when the car is off, the dash cam is only pulling power from the cell link B and not from the vehicle battery itself, thereby assuring that there will be no dead battery. So with all that being said, uh, we really do like the Beamer Tech product. Uh, Beamer Tech has been uh, gracious enough to add us as a dealer and we love selling it because on BMW vehicles, you can't go wrong using their interface. It gives you factory grade features like backup camera, like front view camera, like cell phone mirroring and many more that you can do and not worry about affecting your BMW vehicle and almost all of the installations are plug and play and that is a very, very good thing when you're working with a complex vehicle like a BMW. So if you or somebody you know is interested 
interested in buying a Beamer Tech product and you're in the Toronto, Ontario, Canada area or anywhere in North America for that matter and you have a question, feel free to give us a call 647-439-4485 or 1-866-824-4118. Uh, you can also email us sales at lockdownsecurity.ca. We do have a, a specific Beamer Tech form that we ask you to fill out that gives us the information we need about you and your vehicle so we can get you the right product. But it's very easy to uh, to purchase and it's, um, it's uh, a very good installation process as well. So with all that being said, if you or somebody you know wants to add Beamer Tech products or dash cameras or front cameras or rear cameras, whatever automotive electronics you want to add to your car, Lockdown Security is your source. 647-439-4485, 1-866-824-4118. If you like this video, hit the like button. And if you could, subscribe to our YouTube channel. It goes a long way to help us make more videos like this in the future. Thank you very much and thanks for watching this video.